So, four cups of flour, little granulated garlic, and this is just gonna be for the dough. Parmesan, Parm. thank you, brother. Cayenne. Okay, and if you wanna get about uh, half of that bowl of some warm water, about 110 degrees, because I know that you have a temperature finger, uh, 110 degrees just to kind of bloom that yeast, or just bring it over and I'll hit it, okay? Okay, so a little heat from the cayenne, not too much. Okay, Parmesan's done. That all comes together. That's my dry mix. Give that a little pulse, kind of mix it all together. Now, I let some yeast uh, bloom in 110 degree water. So I've got the yeast uh, ready to pour into this. And I'm gonna add one egg. Throw that in the compost. I got my uh, flour standing by just in case. Just in case I need a little bit more. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna get the dough out, knead it about uh, 10, 12 times, split it in half, give Gary some, we'll kind of roll it out to about quarter inch thick, hit some of these, the cheddar cheese inside, roll it again, and then cut it into these thin strips to roll out some pretzels. You ready to help me? I'm in. Okay, buddy, I'll start the dough. Good? Good. A little bit of a odd edge here, but don't worry about that. We'll kind of firm it up. Okay, Gary, so then I come in here, about an inch, inch and a half, cut it off like that, take it, kind of uh, roll it back into itself. Okay. A little bit more flour. Okay, so this is how we do it. We roll it up. Gary, do me a favor. You got an egg right there, I and I need, some, uh, I need some wash. So we'll take this. We got the pretzel all put together. We give it a little twist. Bring it over and punch it right down in like that. Okay, so before it absorbs all the egg, um, all that egg wash has a little bit of milk. I want to go ahead and get this on quickly. So some poppy seeds, of course. There we go. Now I've got my oven preheated about 350 degrees. Do we have to swap? Yes. Yeah, good on that. Train sides. Go. Ninjas. You're good. You're good. <laughs> yeah. Well, here you go. What else do we have here? A little sesame seed. Is that it? Okay. So after a little bit of time, a little bit of temp, uh, sitting out, look at how these kind of grew a bit, and they're even going to puff up a little bit more because of that yeast that we put in there. So some sesame seeds all the way across the board here. There we go. Okay. Actually, this one needs just a touch more. There we go. Okay, Garrett, go ahead and grab one of these. Over to 350, about 16 to 18 minutes. Throw yours on the bottom, brother. My awesome pretzels are filled with Parmesan and cheddar cheese, then topped with poppy seeds, sesame seeds, onion flakes, and crunchy kosher salt. You may want to make a double batch of these babies because they're always the first to go.